Despite Pope Francis's call to spare the life of a woman scheduled to be executed tonight, a Georgia parole board has denied clemency. A local archbishop made the appeal on the pontiff's behalf in the case of Kelly Gissendanner. Gissendanner is scheduled to receive lethal injection at 7 p.m. for the 1997 murder of her husband. The letter referenced the Pope's speech to Congress last week when he called for an end to the death penalty. The Catholic Archdiocese of Atlanta held a news conference to discuss the letter. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to read to you now the text of the letter that was issued uh, in the name of Pope Francis. The 29th of September, 2015, addressed to the members of the board of the Georgia Parole Board. As the personal representative of His Holiness, Pope Francis, to the United States of America, I make an urgent appeal on his behalf for a commutation of the death sentence of Miss Kelly Gissendonner, who is scheduled to be executed later today. As the Holy Father said in his address to the joint session of Congress last Thursday, and I quote, this conviction of our responsibility to defend human life at every stage has led me from the beginning of my ministry to advocate at different levels for the global abolition of the death penalty. I am convinced that this way is the best, since every life is sacred. Every human being is endowed with an inalienable dignity, and society can only benefit from the rehabilitation of those convicted of crimes. While not wishing to minimize the gravity of the crime for which Ms. Gissendonner has been convicted, and while sympathizing with the victims, I nonetheless implore you in consideration of the reasons that you have been presented to your board to commute the sentence to one that would better express both justice and mercy. Please be assured of my prayers as you consider this request by Pope Francis for what I believe would be a just act of clemency. With deep respect and an appreciation for your dedicated service to the people of Georgia, I am sincerely yours, Archbishop Carlo Maria Viganò, Apostolic Nuncio.